Richard Fitzwilliams told Express.co.uk There is no doubt the Duchess of Cambridge and her husband want the christening of the baby boy to be private He said, there is no doubt that William and Kate want the christening of their children to be private, but there will also be the opportunity for watching the royal family as they arrive There are the traditional staged photographs and the symbolism will be most important George was christened in the Chapel Royal, where Diana's body lay before her funeral Charlotte was christened at the Church of St. Mary Magdalene on the Sandringham estate where Diana was christened Mr. Fitzwilliams insisted Prince Louis will wear a replica of the 1841 gown world by Queen Victoria's eldest daughter during the ceremony He added the Archbishop of Canterbury will lead the event, although an exact date for the christening has not been confirmed The royal commentator went on, he will undoubtedly wear a replica of the 1841 gown used for Queen Victoria's eldest daughter Victoria which all royal babies were christened in until it was replaced by a copy in 2008 He will be christened by the Archbishop of Canterbury using the lily font with water from the river, but the ceremony will be private With Prince Harry and Princess Eugenia's two possibilities However he declared the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge typically choose friends over family in this regard He continued, there will be speculation as to whether Harry, Beatrice, or Eugenie will be among Lewis's godparents, the trend so far has been for almost all William and Kate's choices to be friends and not family The expected discretion of the royal christening marks a divergence from monarchs dating back to Queen Victoria's reign according to the expert But even to the royal family of today seem to value privacy with the public christening of Princess Eugenie being an exception to the rule Mr. Fitzwilliams said, royal christenings emphasize the close link between the monarchy and the church, they used to be public affairs into Queen Victoria's reign There was a ferocious row at the christening of George William, son of the future George II At Queen Victoria's christening which was private there was a dispute over her name which was actually Alexandrina Victoria Eugenie was christened in a public service, though this was an exception to recent royal christenings which have been private